Ontario. This should be one heck of a wrestling contest. I mean, you got Angelina Love, as I said, former four-time TNA Knockouts champion, trained by Bill DeMott and El Fuego. Has over 13 years experience in the business, definitely feels at home inside the squared circle. However, her opponent, Jasmine, as I said before as well, about two years of experience, constantly still growing here in the professional wrestling world and has a lot of heads turning her way. And a lot of people are saying that Jasmine could possibly be the future of women's wrestling in Canada. And of course, we can't forget as well, the special guest referee Taylor Wilde, former TNA knockout champion herself. It'll be interesting to see as she calls this right down the middle. Oh, pull the hair by Jasmine. Beautiful nip up right there though by Angelina Love and pulling the hair back down. Giving her a bit of a taste of her own medicine right now. It's Taylor Wilde tells her to wash the hair, keep it clean. Big forearm shots right now by Angelina Love. Irish whip reversal, duck down, big boot to the chest, and a big clothesline by Angelina Love. And another one. The last time we saw Angelina Love, was back at Summer Showdown here at the Live Act Theater where she defeated Zandra Bale. Big slam right there by Angelina. One, two, only a two count. That's a smart move by Jasmine for someone who doesn't have that much experience. Rolling to the outside, trying to give herself a bit of a break. Oh, hanging Angelina on the top rope right there. Beautiful move. Trying to go for a quick pin, but that's definitely not going to put away someone with the experience and the ability of Angelina Love. Well, I will say Taylor Wilde is definitely the best looking official I've seen all night, that's for sure. Jasmine now mocking Angelina Love, almost like a, her own little nod to the beautiful people in TNA back in the day. It's gonna be very interesting to see with these former two TNA knockouts, if you know, Taylor Wilde's gonna be able to call this right down the middle and call it fair. Are you suggesting we're gonna see some foul play? Um, well, maybe, it, it's possible. You have to really think it's a huge opportunity for Jasmine. Oh, no, absolutely. I was saying that before. I mean, a woman who has not had a lot of experience, but definitely is getting a lot more people seeing her ability day in and day out in all these different cities across Ontario is taking on someone who is such a world-renowned professional wrestler in Angelina Love. I mean, Angelina Love trained by people like El Fuego and Bill DeMond. Oh, and then that's that type of experience to get the boot up and get the elbow up at the last second to be able to take out Jasmine. Gonna show running on the top. Sunset flip. Now Jasmine's doing quite well for herself here. And it's, it is quite remarkable. When you think about how long Jasmine has been inside that ring. We started seeing her at Squared Circle Live only about a year ago. And now she's in there and taking it to Angelina Love. Absolutely, and I mean as well, you gotta think about it as well. Angelina Love, she's been wrestling for over 13 years. I mean, for a person who's as experienced as her, it's gonna be very interesting to see if she has any, you know, long lasting injuries throughout the years of being a professional wrestler that possibly Jasmine might be able to capitalize on and get the upset win here tonight at the Live Act Theater. 
This is one of those matches where it's, it could do a whole lot for Jasmine's career, but really does not anything for Angelina Love's career. Well, you know, Angelina Love has everything to lose and absolutely nothing to gain. And Jasmine is the opposite, where she has everything to gain and absolutely nothing to lose here. Jasmine is already gaining a lot right now, just being in the ring with someone as technically sound and as world-renowned as Angelina Love. Even if she walks away with a victory or not, she's going to walk away with a learning experience that she can be able to take in matches in the future. And that type of information is sometimes more valuable than a win. As long as you learn from a loss, a loss never really is a loss. Or she could win. Absolutely. And, and then she always has that one token saying that, you know, I am better than Angelina Love. Oh. You know, those jawbreakers just make my skin crawl. So do women. That's what I've heard. Wait, women makes your skin crawl? No, it makes your skin crawl. Oh. Apparently you have wax stuck in your ears, too. It is loud in here at the Live Act Theater of Whippy, Ontario. Square Circle Live's Adrenaline Cup Tournament 2014. Angelina Love's all fired up here. Firing back now, taking it to Jasmine. And this is definitely not what Jasmine wants to happen. She does not want Angelina Love to get in that rhythm that she is so used to having throughout the years and be able to take it to Jasmine. And a beautiful bulldog. This could be it right here. Yeah, say goodnight to Jasmine. There's a cover, one, two, only a two. I gotta give it credit, Taylor Wilde has been calling this right down the middle. Hooking both legs. I shouldn't think that Taylor Wilde would do anything shifty here to help out her fellow friend, her fellow Hall of Fame of BSC. And that's exactly why I would suspect that possibly it could happen. Just because they trained together and they've and they've, they you know, broke in together and they still to this day are very good friends? Yeah. I don't know. I still think... As Jasmine almost picks up a three count there. Relentless with that cover. I mean, this is an uphill battle for Jasmine regardless. Regardless who's the referee or not because of the person she's in the ring with. Jasmine's going to have to try and take this match and quickly... Oh, put it away. Like a jumping the, flatliner. Shades of Canyon. Chris Canyon, that is. Yeah, but there ain't no better, nobody better than Canyon. Angelina trying to pull her back into the middle of the ring, go for the cover, away from the ropes. Ooh, that was... See, that could have almost been a fast count, in my opinion, right there. I disagree, but go, go on. I, I mean, look. Did you see how she was counting before? And I did. did you, and did you see how she was counting then? I don't know. I'm, are you saying she's somehow related to Scott Armstrong? I'm saying that she's been going to the Nick Patrick School of Refereeing, then possibly yes. Oh, double boots right to the face. The school I'd like to attend. Why, because you want to be able to learn to be a cheat too? Of course you would. Nick Patrick made money. Oh, and foot. Oh, his feet on the ropes. Jasmine with the victory. Wow, I am shocked. Jasmine now after the bell, stomping away on Angelina Love. She got those boots up, and I don't care who you are. Angelina Love ran face first into two boots right in the face, and she knocked herself out in the back of her head, whiplash against that canvas. And now Jasmine is putting the boots to her, adding insult to injury here. This is a huge victory. Oh, Taylor Wilde now. See, I told you these two would work together. I didn't know what it was going to be after the match, but there you go. 